snake. About the escaped children. Eli confessed. The way he tells it, they wanted to go back to the battlefield. Don't rob them of their freedom, he said. If you bring them all back, there will be consequences. <sighs> Next to be asking for our surrender. Consequences? What consequences? No idea. That's all I have for now. You're too attached to those kids. Stop protecting Eli. Listen to yourself. Let me question him, and we'll get some real answers. Not necessary. I'll report as and when. Side ops list updated. Okay, subject is in. Extraction arrived at mother base.
saving those animals. Oh, snake! What is it, snake? Cayo Pinto! Amanda and I taught Cecile how to make it. She picked it up so fast. I was really surprised. I guess Parisians have cooking in the blood. Are Cecile and Amanda doing okay? I wonder why they haven't visited. I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? She's been acting differently lately. Before, she'd respond to conversation. Just as long as it didn't conflict with her timeline. But now, nothing gets a reaction from her. What happened? No idea. Well, Miller did go and tell her that Skullface is dead. If anyone should want revenge against him, it would be her. It's not exactly like an angel of peace to cheer for someone's death, now is it? There, take a look at this too. See it? Right there. The wound is open. Yeah. It was all closed up, and then it went back to this. But why? The medic has no idea how it happened. He figures it must have been self-inflicted. said he had thought of the title already. Love Deterrence. As if he had done the hard part. Deterrence? Love? Deterrence? Deterrence is... It is when nuclear weapons prevent war, right? I do not see how love fits in. But it was too late to complain, so I just sat and listened to the tape of Miller's backing guitar and the professor's melody over and over again. I guess the melody is more Professor Galvez's creation than Miller's, but on the whole, I think it is actually a good song. First, it goes for your heart with a sorrowful opening, but then you feel revitalized as the song goes on. Miller grew up in post-war Japan. Maybe that is why the song has that kind of balance. Long ago, I heard some Japanese music called Enka, I think. It sounded this way. But I wonder why it has to sound sad in the first place. Miller called it love deterrence. Doesn't that mean he had a love song in mind? All I see of Miller and women is the way he fools around with a lot of them at once. But maybe he has had his heart broken too. And what about me? I found myself thinking about Chico and Snake as well. I know Chico has a crush on me. So naturally he should come to mind. But why Snake? 
saved me, and I feel indebted to him. But I thought that was all he meant to me. Why does my heart flutter when I think of him? It is embarrassing to be unable to control this emotion. There has to be a way to suppress it, to forget it. But maybe that is what love deterrence is? With that thought in mind, I went to my desk and began to write and write. Just three days left until peace day. <laughs>